All right, ladies and gentlemen, do you know what is the worst thing of packing? That you always will need something that you packed before actually leaving. I need socks, ladies and gentlemen, to put on my bare feet. Because it took a little shower today. All right, do you know what? I want to do something that I haven't done the whole summer. I want to put all the blinds open and let all of the possible light to shine in that trailer, ladies and gentlemen, for one last time, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> Good morning. Huh. Parallel parking. I'm the master. Call me the master. All right, I have my script that I printed out a few, a week ago, two or something, and I'm gonna go grab a breakfast and I'm gonna read it over and I have a pen in my bucket, so I'm gonna write notes around it. All right, very good ladies and gentlemen, very good. I found something that was a very big mistake into the script. It was about the composition of one shot that is in the past and the guy's talking about the same shot in the future, but it's completely different in his speech. So I had to redo everything over here. That was perfect. I found it. Ah, good. And the scene was not quite right. So, um, a breakfast, ladies and gentlemen. Breakfast. Yeah, that's what that place is after the season's done. Dad, remember what it was three years ago when I arrived? Do you remember that? It was 28th of May, 2 in the morning, ladies and gentlemen. I arrived on the train station that's right over that, across that building over there. It was insane. The fog was so thick, I couldn't see a thing. And I met Bibi and, um, and Chrissy the same night. We apparently we were supposed to be working in the same hotel. Go figure. Ha ha. And we started roaming around the, the streets of Old Orchard Beach, trying to find where that magical place Grand Beach in is. In that huge fog. And I saw a great fox at the same that night. That was insane. It was a good. I can't say a good look because I was exhausted <laughs> from 15 hours of flying and. Now I have to spend six more hours with complete strangers in cold, in the fog, unwelcomed in America. <laughs> it was supposed to be the land of choices and freedom. What am I saying? I don't know. Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. Let's grab some coffee and go down to the beach. To the beach. Yeah, that's the closest that I'm getting to the water this year. Last year I came here only once and I almost killed my camera. That's the closest I get. Look at that. And then now you can get me. I'm just far from you. And a huge wave. Yeah, humor. Ha. Wow. For one last time I come to deposit a golf cart key over here. Let me do an inspection. Go do an inspection. Maybe a flat tire. I know. It was intentional. Yeah. Alright, let's start them by numbers. First, second, third, and fourth. There we go. And pretty much that leads up the scene that I need to shoot with a girl that is coming up, uh, hopefully right now. Just do those. I don't care if you want to look at that or not. Doodles are the best. I love doodles. Like I doodle and, on everything. And that's still the like to be able to do it, it's wonderful. For sure. Those these are really old. You can look through that if you want. Alright, did you see these drawings? Did you see that girl? That was Michaela, ladies and gentlemen. That is one of the most wonderful people that I met for the past three years. And I'm not exaggerating a bit. A bit. She has the curiosity and the energy of a little kid. And yet at the same time she has the, the feelings and the brains of a grown-up person. She's a wonderful gem. And uh, we should just shot a little thing that, uh, uh, for, uh, for a little uh, grandparents haiku and I really hope that I, we top it off. But uh, apparently she can draw. I 
didn't know that. Okay, son. The closest thing to friends. Yet again, I'm feeling that way. Do you know what is the sad thing, though? Um, let me hear talk about like not feeling depressed or like bad down or whatever. The bad, the worst thing is that right now I'm living and I'm taking on an adventure. That's what people say. But hey, I can tell you that my adventure started five months ago when I left Bulgaria, if you ask me. But um, I'm not just going to a new place. I am leaving that place. And that place, ladies and gentlemen, was my shelter for the past three years. It was the place that I migrated to, that I came when when there was a storm coming up. That was the place where I found the closest thing that I have to friends. That's why that that's why I feel sad and that's why I feel depressed and that's why I feel felt down. Cause it's not because I'm moving on. It's because I have to live that. It's not necessarily a great place, but. It was my place. It's the same thing as my is a trailer. It's a shitty trailer. It's a piece of shit, but it's my piece of shit. You know what I mean? Now feel, we feel excited because I get a pack, <laughs> and it's insane in my trailer, dude. You gotta see that. It's just. Whew. All right, ladies and gentlemen. Well, pretty much that's it. Look at that. I stripped the whole thing down. These are boxes that I don't need. Everything is pretty much done. It's empty. And I want to show you something that, look at that, on my left pocket, something that I put in my left pocket uh, on the day when I left uh, was that, ladies and gentlemen. And that is uh, a coin of one euro. And that coin was given to me by Rado. Remember Rado, the top friend of mine that I have back in Bulgaria? He gave me that and he whispered in my ear so none of my family heard that was keep that for me and I put it in my left pocket in my other jacket I bought this one this jacket and I moved the coin into the left pocket that that coin is gonna stay in my left pocket until that guy comes around and I really hope he does somehow because he's a good person he just needs to translate his books and there is a lot of market for his imagination there is a lot of markets I'm completely serious but that vlog is not about him that vlog is about me look at all that Look, that's, that's, uh, um, I really hope I can close that. But pretty much I got everything. I'm double checking, actually, fourth time checking everything right now, so I don't want to forget anything. And uh, I will go hang out with Galen tonight for one last time. See them, guys. What are they doing? So, yeah, I'll check around. <sighs> Look at all that mold and everything. Good old trailer. Good old trailer. Good night.